Hi everyone, the Big Tank is back and for the first time in this channel, not everything that I need for this project will fit on the table. So let me show you the first set of parts for this build. <laughs> nice. Before we start putting bolts and things on this, uh, let's talk about today's video sponsor, Wix. Wix is a free platform that allows you to create highly customizable, professional and robust websites. Wix takes care of all the heavy lifting, like keeping your website safe and secure, custom domains and mailboxes, email marketing and more and it gives you infinite possibilities to make each website personal and unique, allowing you to create whatever you want, whether you are a novice or an advanced designer. Wix allows you to create a website for almost any purpose, personal or professional, and offers hundreds of templates, unlimited pages, and top-grade hosting for free. And you can upgrade to one of their premium plans to get even more. I used Wix to create a website where I answered the most asked questions about this tank project using one of the beautifully designed templates, mixing text, video and images effortlessly. Now there is a website that will keep answering those questions so I can keep building the tank. Go to wix.com slash go slash Ivan and build your free website today. Let's go back to the tank. And even if this is a mostly 3D printed tank, uh, I will put some uh, steel and aluminium reinforcements in it so, so I, I can keep it because you know if I don't do that I, I, I will break it. So give me a second. Now I will try a dry fit with the beams and the 3D printed parts and if everything more or less fits correctly I will start putting bolts. Making tanks, if they are this big, requires a little bit of effort and convincing. But I'm winning. This one, I'm winning. <laughs> I won. <laughs> one half of the chassis complete. Let's go for the other one. Beep, 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 beep. I file the edges of the profile so it doesn't get caught inside the, the 3D printed parts. So let's see, let's see if this one goes a little bit smoother. And the second half is complete. Well complete, I did the dry fit, this was too much work. It seems that I'm full of energy and I broke the table. I need a better table. I 
I've been able to fit only four beams uh, on this side and I'm not sure if those four will fit on the other side. But we will keep moving forward because we need to do lots of stuff. And well, if anything breaks, I will print it again. That's how this works. It seems that I didn't measure the beams correctly, so I have to take it apart and remove Eight millimeters. I did cut a little bit more, just in case. Now I should put all the bolts uh, that join the parts, but for now I will only put those that keep it uh, together because I'm not sure if I'm going to use the same holes for other features and those are a lot of bolts. Okay, this is all one now. I installed only one third of the bolts and it took me around an hour. So <laughs> quite, quite a lot of work. And now I can, I think I could still lift it if I wanted to, but that's, that's not all for today. I'm afraid that when I'm finished, this will have to stay here until I get help or a crane. <laughs> <laughs> now, now it weighs a little bit more, but I'm not finished. The chassis needs more parts. These are the side plates and this one goes in here, but it seems that the holes that I bought to put in here are too short. So I made myself a set of bolts with M5 threaded rod and some nylock nuts on the ends. So let's see if those are good enough. So for those of you that thought that this was going to tank, yes and no. Well, the chassis of the big tank is complete and I have a whole set of new parts to assemble. So expect an update very soon. Thanks a lot to Wix for sponsoring this video. Go to wix.com slash go slash Ivan. Thanks a lot to all my Patreons for helping me with this crazy project. Please consider supporting me on Patreon so I can keep doing this. 
and please consider subscribing to this channel because there will be a lot of more of this soon. And now please go and make something!